Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Loki and today I'm going to be helping you guys how to set up the Elgato HD60 Pro. It's very simple to do and it's also quite frustrating to people who don't really know what they're doing. But today I'm going to be helping you guys and pretty much what you want to first do is obviously plug your Elgato HD60 Pro inside of your streaming PC. Then once you have done that, I'm going to bring a guide up just so I can show you guys on how to do it. But to start off guys, make sure the Elgato HD60 Pro is inside of your streaming PC. And then the next step is that you want to find a HDMI port on your graphics card. And also just link that into your HDMI in on your Elgato. Like so. And then obviously you want a connection to your monitor which you're going to be gaming on on your gaming PC. So a display port for a 1080 Ti it might be different for other graphics cards, but on a 1080 Ti it's a display port. Um, but again, if you do have a different graphics card, it's going to be the same instance. Just plug it into your monitor like so, and that's pretty much it. So once you've got that done, that's literally all you have to do. So next, what you're going to want to do is go right click on your gaming PC, go to NVIDIA control panel. And once that loads, you will find that you now have a Elgato as a screen. So my gaming screen is the Acer XB270H. It's a 144Hz panel. So I'm going to be obviously gaming on this. So what I want to do next is click on number one as it's my gaming monitor. Right click and click clone with. And because Elgato is under number three, I'm going to clone with number three. So once they are completed and you can see them both merge together like so, hit apply. Your screen will go black, so do not worry. And then you will receive a prompt message saying, do you want to save changes? Click yes. So now you should have one and three or whatever configuration you've got. Just make sure that your gaming monitor is merged with your Elgato. Then what you want to go and do is go to change resolution. Make sure your main monitor is at the correct refresh rate. Mine's at 144, so I am fine. My Elgato is also 144. However, for some reason, it sticks at 60 FPS in window mode on all games. If I go in full screen mode, it goes out above 60 FPS, which is good. But window mode for some reason locks the 60 FPS. And if anyone's got a suggestion on how to get rid of that, please do respond to me in the comments because it is really annoying and playing full screen games all the time is quite annoying, especially when you click the Windows mode button and you just want to go to Discord or whatever. You can't do it unless the game closes for a second. So if you guys do know how to get the window mode, please let everyone know in the comments. I would appreciate it. So after you've done that, you're pretty much done there. So we're going to actually set up now how to connect the two PCs together. So we're going to hop over to the stream PC and show you guys how it's done from there. Hey, what's going on guys? For some reason, the audio cut out and also the video cut out on the last recording. So I'm just going to whiz through this really quick and just make sure you follow very carefully, you know, stop and pause if you want. I can promise you this does work. I did get it working on my stream. And if you don't believe me, go to my Twitch, which will be in the description and go to the most recent streams. It does work. And I hope you guys enjoy. I hope it's helped. And hopefully there's some more documentation that Elgato would, would provide on how to get 144 Hertz. But again, if any of you guys know how to get it working, if you guys have it working, please let me know in the description. I would highly appreciate it. And yeah, hope this tutorial helps and catch you guys later. Also guys, if you look at the audio, you can see that the game audio is there. It's just the audio messed up and so the recording. I have no idea why. I'm going to try and figure it out. This was not with the Elgato. This was the core PC. I think it was because I had two OBSs open, so that's probably caused an issue. But I promise you guys, it does work. Give it a try. If you have any problems, make sure you guys join my Discord and I'll set it up for you guys manually. 
by live chatting you or something like that um but 100 percent, it does work Again, just look at the audio when I shoot, it's perfect, it's all in sync, and thanks to their zero latency, it's fantastic. So, now you guys know how to set her up. It's very simple to do, however, there's a few bugs with the window mode and full screen mode. The full screen mode will allow you to go above 60 fps, windowed will not. Still have no idea why, but, but again, let me know in the comments guys if you know how to fix it. I would highly appreciate it and I will pin your comment just to help other people as well. So, thank you very much for watching guys. This has been the Elgato HD60 Pro setup for dual PCs. This is how I do it for streams and I will also give a comparison to what the streams used to look like and what they look like now. So thank you guys, leave a like, subscribe and comment and I shall catch you guys in the next video.